Welcome Brainers! Recently, many users have reported that the Windows recovery environment is missing important options such as command prompt, system restore, startup repair, and reset this PC, etc. If you are experiencing this issue, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll demonstrate how to bring back these essential features to your recovery mode. Let's jump right in. Solution 1. Enable Windows Recovery Environment. If you find yourself on this screen, simply choose the back button, then proceed by selecting Continue. This will take you to your Windows login. If you cannot log in for any reason, please try the other two solutions in this video. Once you're logged into Windows, search for CMD and run Command Prompt as an administrator. In the Command Prompt, type reagency slash info and press Enter. Please check the Windows RE status, if it's disabled, then this is the cause of your problem. Now run the command reagency slash enable, to enable Windows RE. Double check the status to ensure it's now enabled. Please close all open windows, and try to access your recovery environment. While there are multiple methods to access it, I usually prefer holding the shift key and selecting restart. This will eventually take you to the recovery environment, where you should find all the options that were previously missing. Solution 2. Use automatic recovery. To trigger automatic recovery, you need to restart or start your PC, and wait until you see the manufacturer's logo or your usual first boot screen. When you see it, immediately press and hold the power button until your computer turns off completely. Once it's turned off, wait a couple of seconds and repeat this force shutdown process two to three times or until you see the preparing automatic recovery screen. After following these steps, you will reach the automatic recovery screen like this. At this stage do not press any keys, just wait for it to load. Once it's fully loaded, you'll find all the options you need right here, including reset this PC, command prompt, system restore, and more. Solution 3. Use Windows Installation Media. For this solution, you'll need Windows Installation Media, which can either be a bootable DVD or USB drive. If you don't have it, you can easily create one by following the link provided in the video description. Please insert your Windows Installation Media into your computer and restart. When you see the manufacturer's logo, press the key to enter the boot menu. This key is usually F12, F10, Escape, or some other key depending on your PC or motherboard model. Navigate and select the option to boot from the Windows installation media. When you see this, immediately press any key on your keyboard. If needed, change the language and select Next. Once you reach the installation screen, please look for the Repair Your Computer option in the lower left corner and select it. This will bring you to a screen similar to your default recovery screen. Choose Troubleshoot. And here you go. You now got all advanced options, such as Command Prompt, System Restore, and Startup Repair. Please be aware the Reset This PC option will not be available when booting from Windows Installation Media. I hope this helpful. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to see our videos at the top of your search results. Thanks for watching.